tell, tell, tell people, pepperoni. Tell people pepperoni. Cheese and pepperoni. <laughs> Chicago is a pizza city whether you're team deep dish, team thin crust, or team tavern style. Regardless of preference, you'll be glad to know that this beloved Northwest spot is back in business. We met our dear friends Alex and his wife Tuyan during the pandemic when we stumbled upon their incredible Serbian bakery, Sandy's. For trios, Alex pulled his godfather Frank out of retirement after two years and asked him to help him master the secret that makes his pizza and the business that he ran for 30 years so popular. His old fans in the community couldn't be more excited. <laughs> so, if you guys remember our friends from Sandy's Bakery, well, they're now behind this pizzeria called Trio's Pizza. Yeah, we just kind of stop by to give him a visit and so Nico could meet Tuyan and her husband and try out some pizza. Yes. Alex and Tuyan renovated every corner of this place but kept the old ovens. Frank I heard uh, they pulled you out of retirement for this one. Yeah but then you're getting a little tired. <laughs> <laughs> Why pizza specifically? Uh, I love to eat pizza. I feel like uh, pizza was a good uh, adventure. And Frank, my godfather, he's in the, in the pizza industry, so I was like, let's uh, let's like hold him up. Yeah, so kind of like the your transition from the bakery. To yeah, the definitely, definitely. Frank took over Trio's Pizza in 1991 after losing his job at a bottle cap company. The pizzeria was originally opened by three young men about eight years earlier. And after running the place for over 30 years, he retired and sold in 2022. When the business that bought it put it back on the market, Alex and Tuyan couldn't resist and jumped at the opportunity. You know, a lot of customers been like asking for trails here from mm -hmm. the neighborhood. They love the pizza, and we're like, "Hey, Frank, you know, before how's your retirement?" <laughs> <laughs> now, like, you know, we uh, would like to reopen trails. You know, just show us, lead us the way, because you're the master here. And Frank said, uh, "Yes, I'm bored from my retirement. I just stay in my garage. I'm just calling us." <laughs> I was gonna ask you, so how do you guys get into the food business? I know you have like family who's involved. To be honest, for me, when I graduated from uh, Dominican University, uh, I, know I had a degree in business. Uh -huh. And I was like, oh, I don't know, let's see what I'm gonna do. And then when I met Alex, uh, his family would own Sammy's Bakery, and I, I like to cook too. Yeah. So my mom in law like, taught me how to make like all the cakes, the yeah. Serbian dishes. And then now all the great taught me uh, how to make the dough, mm -hmm. the sauce, everything. All the customers are very yeah. happy that we're back. Yeah. And, like, for this, like, customers will do it to wait like two hours. Yeah, oh, that's nice. Yeah, yeah. So, we even got Nico special. Yeah, I'm like, I have to test them. The parent tax. Nice and warm. <laughs> chili soup is where it's at. Really. Very beefy and cheesy. Where have I heard that before? <laughs> mm -hmm. So what do you got here? We got half of the trio's deluxe and half cheese. Yeah, so want a little piece of each. Yeah. Mm -hmm, cool. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I think we're both hungry. I'm gonna eat two pieces and they're cheesy beef. This is the item that I was really excited about. Yep. It's kind of like an Italian beef with uh, some cheese on it. And I've always thought, it's like, hey, that, wouldn't it be great to put cheese on this? And they did it, right? So that's what I'm excited yeah. to try. Cheers. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, au jus. I can never <laughs> say that word. Yeah, au jus. So it's, it's slightly juicy, right? It's kind of wet. You got to be careful. It's really well seasoned. It's not. Yeah, that's, this is a really good au jus. I like it. Beef is really tender. It's moist because, you know, obviously, put the au jus in. And then the cheese just adds that extra layer. It's really good. Mm. It's a really good aroma. And I really like Italian beefs. Like, um,. I tend to get it with everything. Uh, peppers are a little bit spicy for me sometimes. Yeah, I know. Some people are like, wow, how do you not want peppers? Well, I usually order without the peppers. I don't want to sweat while I'm eating my sandwich. <laughs> so this is just basically the beef with some au jus and some cheese. Really good. Really, really, really like thin it. Really thinly sliced. Mm -hmm. mm. Pretty perfect. 
Yeah. What's on the in the pizza? Um, I didn't look. I didn't take a look at the ingredients. To me, it seems like like one of these um, supreme pizzas. It mm -hmm. has like peppers, peppers onions, onions, sausage. I can see mushrooms. Yeah. So, so, no for Nico, basically. Yeah. Because <laughs> <laughs> he, he would take it's out like everything. Cheese. Yeah. So that's why we got half cheese and half uh, half trio deluxe. In. You want to stop talking? Yes. Cheers. Good. That's good. I really like a good Supreme Deluxe, you know, kind of like yeah. everything on it kind of pizza. I like the dough. Yes. It's really good. Like the crust? We've tried a lot of thin crust pizzas, a lot of the uh, tavern style. Mm -hmm. Not all of them are good. So yeah. <laughs> really good. Yeah, this one's good. I like the, I like the crust. And uh, you guys know I like my saucy pizzas and this one had a really nice combination of sauce mm -hmm. and cheese. Though it doesn't come out as much in this one because of the, the ingredients, right? Uh, you get a lot of that sausage, pepper, onion flavor. So I don't get a, a lot of the sauce, but I do like your sauce. So this is really good. Uh, yeah. You guys got a hit on your hands. <laughs> I think it was really cool that we got to meet Frank. He's been doing pizzas for 30, 35 years. 35 years, yeah. He came out of retirement to, yeah. to help Tui and Alex out. So. Yeah, he's a man of a few words, but... <laughs> You can see that he has some talent here. Yeah, he has some love for pizza. And love for his customers too. So he was happy to start seeing them back and going mm -hmm. back to the store. So it was great. We're going to be supporting Tuyan and Alex, you know, lovely people. And we want to give them some love. And if you guys are in the area, definitely stop by and okay. try out some of their stuff. Get the cheesy beef and get, uh, beef. get a trio deluxe. We forgot about the tiramisu. <laughs> but here it is. Mm. Oh damn, that's, do that's not it. miss out on a tiramisu. Ah, yeah. Not this yet. 